time before and the name was Mashail. I think she's now in Saudi Arabia. How long ago was that? That was over 25 years back. Nishan uh, was the horse who gave me the happiest times in my life and he's just, now he's uh, standing uh, stud uh, but he was the first the best uh, horse in training. Nishan's going to take some pegging mat though. 100 out in these by a length and a half from Versa PY. Back in third is Nassim. A third win, round three of the Al Maxim Challenge for Nishan. I was in, uh, in the uh, dressage and uh, I found, found a horse uh, which was very nice. I still have him actually. He's very old now uh, and decided to buy him and uh, that's how we started. Yeah, and I remember calling my wife, telling her that we have a new boy. And, <laughs> well, she thought something at the beginning, then I thought, it's a horse, it's a horse. I am full with expectation, uh, very, very much uh, optimistic, always. But uh, at the same time, because the day before I do my uh, homework, I listen to the broadcaster to the experts and so I prepare myself to the world situation as well but I can't say that I won't be nervous but uh, better than many people if it was left to me I it will be all the time but since some other people are doing that for me I don't mean the trainer or the stable I have some people who work with me and uh, but still it takes a lot of especially when I have a horse uh, racing, uh, it takes some, some time from me. The best moment was here in, uh, uh, in Midan when uh, uh, we got the Maktoum challenge number three and my horses came first and second. This was the, the best moment. When I went. I would like always to be in the w, uh, DWC. Okay. Uh, I hope always. I mean, uh, I've been there. I think last year only I missed it. But this is my ambition always, my goal. The winner of last DWC, and the reason is none why. <laughs> <laughs>